on this acupressure series sessions. Okay, today we are going to discuss about an ancient Japanese technique which utilizes five different points for five different problems. So let us see how this Japanese technique is being employed. Okay, so our here what we are going to do is this thumb finger it represents our worry and anxiety so whenever we feel worry or we get anxious about something what we need to do is gently massage this thumb clockwise and anti-clockwise for a couple of minutes say some you know three to five minutes so you can notice that slowly your anxiety levels gets down and your mood stabilizes okay so the next thing is for index finger this finger represents fear. So whenever you are having fear of any kind of situation or you know anything. So whenever you are experiencing fear what you need to do is you need to massage this index finger. So anti-clockwise and clockwise if you keep rotating for say some 5 to 10 minutes. Slowly you can see that the fear factor reduces or fades away. Okay. Next is the middle finger, it represents anger. Whenever we are put in a situation where we are not able to express ourselves freely and we have, you know, the kind of suppressed anger or where we are not able to exhibit our anger and during that time you can gently, you know, uh, give pressure to the middle finger. You can, you know, sit calmly and then be just giving pressure to your middle finger and you can see that you will be able to let go of that angle very easily. Okay. Next comes the ring finger. This is for the sadness. Usually whenever, you know, uh, sometimes life throws away some certain situations where we tend to become sad. During those times, if we are able to, you know, just give pressure to this uh, ring finger, then we can see that our sadness, uh, you know, our mood changes, shifts from sadness to hope and faith okay we will see the shift from sadness so on the pinky finger this is for whenever we are feeling low self-esteem or low in self-confidence we can give pressure to the ring uh, i mean the pinky finger the little finger and then you can see that our confidence level increases okay so all these things these are all very simple solutions to the day-to-day -day whatever you know emotions we are going through Say for example, if a kid, you know, is worried about the exam or, you know, he's uh, worrying that he's not able to complete the portion or he's having fear of exams. What you can do is you can just uh, simply massage away the fingers, the index and the thumb finger, which, you know, constitutes worry and fear. Thereby you can uh, see the shift in the emotion. Okay, from negative state to positive state, the shift can be seen. If you are doing consistently, okay say for two or three days continuously if you do you can definitely see a shift if it is a minor issue okay thank you stay tuned for our next acupressure series